Hi, before you see me update my Sony a7 IV, I want to show you a quick illustrated guide that I made to update camera firmware by way of a memory card. So you know exactly how I'm going to do it in this video. And I have specific timestamps below so you can jump to see me do the actual update. Number one, download the firmware or the system software update from the internet. Number two, insert a formatted memory card, an SD card, or a CF Express card into your computer or a reader. Number three, access the memory card. The window you see is a root directory. Number four, drag and drop the firmware data into the root directory of the memory card. Number five, eject the memory card, the SD card, or the CF Express card from your computer. Number six, Insert the memory card into slot 1 of your camera. Number 7. Turn on the camera. Number 8. Navigate to version page or body update page. Number 9. Press execute and wait. The screen will go blank while it's updating. Number 10. You're done. You can check the new version number on your camera by navigating back to the version screen. In preparation for the update, you should know what firmware version you have the memory card formatted, the battery fully charged, and the camera not too warm or hot. Let's take a look. To find out what version you have on the camera, press the menu button. Press the setup tab and scroll down to setup option group. Select that. And scroll down to version item. Select that and see what version you have. Now, if you haven't formatted your card, format it. Press the menu button. Press the camera tab. Scroll down to Media Group, select that, and Format. They recommend that you fully charge the battery first or just get a fully charged one. Or you must see three bars or more and also make sure the camera is not hot. Update only after the temperature drops. Okay, let's start. First, you want to go to sony.com slash electronics slash support. Select cameras and camcorders. Digital cameras. Interchangeable lens cameras. E-mount body. ILCE-7 series. And up on top, downloads tab. Select ILCE-7M4. And you see here, system software update version 1.10 SD card slash CF Express card. Select that. Select the first one if you have version 101 or 100. Select the second one if you have later version than 101. If you go from 1.00 or 1.01 to the latest version directly, an error will occur according to Sony. So don't do that. For me, I select this one because I have version 1.01. Click download to get the firmware. After you download the firmware, you can see it's located here. Insert a formatted memory card into your computer or a reader. And you see the drive that belongs to the memory card here. Then double click or access the drive and you are now automatically in the root directory. Now drag and drop the firmware into the root directory of the memory card. Again, the window you see here is the root directory. So the system software data or the firmware is now on the memory card in the root directory of the card. Next, the important thing is to eject the memory card on the computer correctly. Then remove the card with the firmware. Take the memory card with the firmware and insert it into slot 1 of your camera. Next, like before, press the menu button. Press the setup tab and scroll down to setup option group. Select that and scroll down to version item. Select that. Then select software update. Here we go. A version update 1.01 to 1.05 message appears. Select execute on the camera screen and then wait. It may take several minutes. 
the camera will reboot and there you see when the update starts the camera screen will go blank and the access lamp flashes again it will take several minutes to complete if things went wrong just remove the battery and the memory card from the camera and start over again at the point from saving system software data to the memory card you can also reset your camera back to original factory settings but you have to look that up okay when the update is completed the camera will automatically restart and you see this message you can now go and confirm the system software version that you have then you see what version you have but still we're not done we have to move on to the most recent version the version 1.10 select latest update go ahead and download again you have the choice to log in sign in create an account or continue without an account select one and download i would reformat the card again you'll have to repeat the whole thing over again but just watch me do it turn off the camera and take out the card put it in your computer and access it drag and drop the new firmware you ought to rename the file bodydata.dat only then eject properly then remove the card and put it back into the camera turn it back on go to the version page and update again And that's finally it. Congratulations, you have completed the update. And again, thank you for watching. Do come back.